Hey, this Super Rubber Dub track is looking a bit clean, you know. I apologize for that joke. So Wave 5 has actually been revealed. Well, at least part of it. But it's better than nothing. I will take it. So it looks like we might be getting a brand new track in Wave 6 as well. Because, what, that's Wave 4 and now Wave 5 that we've got a brand new track. Hey, listen, I'm not complaining, man. I think that's such a great idea. Especially if these tracks haven't been in Mario Kart Tour yet. Boy, I'm all for it. New Mario Kart is new Mario Kart. And... This one right here, I love to call it the Super Rubber Dub track. Listen, if you remember that game from back in the day, you're an absolute legend. This track actually looks quite interesting and I don't even fully understand the layout yet. I'm just really liking the attention to detail and it just looks like there's lots of phases. Like there's a part where you're way underwater and there's a part where you're gliding. So I don't know if this one is going to be a sectioned race, which that would be a pretty interesting take considering that the last, what, brand new Mario Kart track the Yoshi's Island one was just a regular three lap to race so that would be a nice change of pace and would be a nice inclusion to the booster course pass not gonna lie so far from what we've seen I'm quite a fan of this one okay I promise I'll stop PE Piranha is finally back it's about time and you know what I'm just gonna keep this PE Piranha bit short because all of us theorized it all of us wanted it and I wasn't super surprised when I saw it I was just like yes finally I cannot say the same thing though about Wiggler. I'm sorry, what? Come again? Since when? Okay, I think we all theorized that all of the characters that will be coming to the Booster Course Pass would only be characters that are already in Mario Kart Tour. This is not the case apparently. Not only is Wiggler one of my favorite characters to play as in Mario Kart, this changes everything because he's not in Mario Kart Tour at the moment. I will say that again, Wiggler is currently not a character in Mario Kart Tour at the time of recording this video. So this means I can still get my most wanted character for Wave 6, being Rob. I thought that that was going to be impossible because of the Mario Kart Tour rule, but apparently not. So I'm actually really hoping and praying that we get Rob in Wave 6 now. But going back to Wiggler, I'm very excited about that. Like I said, he's one of my favourite Mario Kart characters. I know that's kind of a controversial thing to say, but bro, he is so weird in Mario Kart 7. I love it. I love it so much. And I'm glad that I'm going to get to play as him again. And just like in Mario Kart 7, he still flips tables every time he gets Gets hit by something i think that is hilarious and amazing i love that thank you nintendo we're also getting kamek which similar to p piranha we did see that coming but considering that this guy has been trying to get in the mario kart franchise ever since mario kart 64 i'm glad we finally got him and is a welcome addition to 8 deluxe oh sorry did i say kamek oh sorry apparently it's karmek I see, my bad, my bad. I would not be surprised if we saw Piranha Plant Cove in this wave, considering that, guess what character is coming. And speaking of the characters that are being added to wave 5, I would also not be surprised if we finally get a Bowser's Castle track in this wave as well. All three of these characters are Mario enemies, so it would make a lot of sense that we finally get a Bowser's Castle track. I have a funny feeling it's going to be one of the SNES Bowser's Castles, because one that was recently remade for tour and two feather cup i think it's pretty safe to say that as we're approaching the end of the booster course pass obviously we've got wave five and then wave six later on this year the picks are going to start to get even more interesting would not be surprised if we see another rainbow road track appear for wave six in conclusion just like the other waves i'm really looking forward to this one wave five of the mario kart 8 deluxe booster course pass dlc for the mario Card 8 Deluxe game. Wait, this isn't Fighters Pass 3? Oh wow, that's what I thought it was this whole time. Thanks Nintendo for clarifying. 